Hey YouTubers, this is Old John. Going to do a real quick video on my new Generac uh, high pressure washer. Uh, I've actually tried it out once, but I didn't have time to make a video then. I'll make a follow up video of it actually in operation, and I'll put a link to this video uh, to, sh to let you know that. Um, it's the 2500 psi max pressure, 2.3 gallon per minute maximum. This was recommended by Consumer Reports. Um, these are the nozzle up here. This one is already on the, the wand, but there are three. Uh, blast, clean, and soap. There are spaces here for two more. If you get the 3000 GPM model or PSI model, you'll get additional uh, nozzles here. So, um, like I say, this is recommended by Consumer Reports. Here's a nice little place to carry your wand. Uh, fuel tank, real quickly, has a nice filter. Um, I might still consider putting a additional inline filter on this, but that's for another day and another video. Um, this is a four cycle engine. It's got a nice little cart that it sits on and this is where you start the engine and you can put your foot here and hold it which is nice. Got plenty of hose. This attaches to the nozzle here. And then to the end of the hose, you hook the other end of the hose to here. Uh, when you're just using water, which is all I've done so far, you hook your garden hose into here. And it needs to be uh, no longer than 50 feet, according to the manual. I guess that has something to do with the pressure. Here is the hose for using detergent, which I haven't used yet. That's why I haven't taken off the wrappings. But uh, one end of this obviously attaches to the unit right here, I believe. And um, then the other end goes into your detergent dispenser, bottle, bucket, whatever. And it's got a little filter in it, which is nice. So that's a pretty simple feature also. Um, anyway, for some reason it has two oil um, filler and check tubes. And this is where you drain the oil. This is where you check the oil. And you got this on each side. This is nice. I don't want to take it out right now, but it's got a a high and a low mark on it and they've got them on both sides and been some speculation as to why they do that they really don't say them in the manual but I think it's so you can pour the oil in on this side and then measure it on the other side just just a thought anyway so this also has a, an oil drain plug right here which is handy this is your on off switch to start it up and then you manipulate your um, choke here and then this is this is the gasoline switch to switch gasoline on or off and this is nice because I think in the winter time you can shut this off this is handy because then you can for winter storage you can shut the gas off drain it and uh, put it away for the winter the gas cap has a nice chain on it it's really sturdy gasketed this is a nice metal gas tank and that's basically all I can think of at the moment but I highly recommend the unit after trying it 
the, the generic 2500 PSI Max 2.3 GPM Max uh, power washer. So that's all for now, YouTubers. Old John, over and out.